Railroad Days took place on Saturday and Sunday and had a huge turnout of railroad fans, young and old. It's a beautiful day here in downtown Brea for the first annual Railroad Days hosted by downtown Brea. The event was usually held in Fullerton for the past 20 years and has now found a new home in downtown Brea. As you can see behind me, they've shut off the entire street to host real life trains, booths, exhibits, and any information you could possibly need or want to know about trains. Good morning to our Railroad Days in Brea downtown. Uh, this is our first year adventure with downtown Brea and the city of Brea. Uh, Chamber of Commerce and I have my grandson Jared with us and we welcome all of us to come and enjoy railroad days. Numerous booths and displays lined the street for train enthusiasts to enjoy and ask questions about. It's cool about my grandson. I'm not really a railroad guy but uh, I do like this Brea stuff that goes on out here. There's all kinds of events they have. Even the mayor of Brea was on hand to give more information about the history of railroad days. Welcome to railroad days in the city of Brea. This is the 11th annual Railroad Days, but it happens to be the first one that we're going to do here in the city of Brea. And the city of Brea, the city council, myself, and all the citizens welcome Railroad Days to the city. There was a train running through the middle of the street for people to enjoy a ride on, and guests could even ride the Brea trolley up the street to see a real Union Pacific locomotive. I like trains. My cousin likes trains. With so much to see and such a great turnout, it looks like Railroad Days may have found a new permanent home here in Brea. Well, it's a great day for trains here at Railroad Days in Brea. For OC News, I'm Shelby Keelick.